Hello and welcome to Brit Twits. My name's Alex. I'm the Twit of the Controller, and I'm joined today by Dan. How are you doing, Dan? I'm very well, mate. How are you? Yeah, yeah, not not too bad. Not too bad. Washing it's... machine packed in last week. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh, but yeah, that could have been better. Like catastrophically. Oh no, there wasn't wasn't too much moisture just in the kitchen. Uh, no more than normal. I live in Wales, so there's not <laughs> quite enough. a lot of moisture in the kitchen, but. No, not a ridiculous it, amount. And as you know, I don't wear clean clothes. I, I was, mainly use it to store cats in. I was also going to say, you're just going to avoid that chest and not bother. What? <laughs> it's to the right. Well, he's chatting. Where is it? Just to the right. Keep going, keep going. Keep going down, 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 down. That one there. See that? You see that chest? See it oh, quite cheers, obvious? buddy. <laughs> Hold on, that's actually quite good. <laughs> I think that's like a counter-attack ball. It's got to be right, surely. Evade and that counter. That is a bloody amazing... I'm pleased. I'm pleased that I saw that. <laughs> Good job, Alex. Good, well played, mate. <laughs> Thanks. No, of course, and uh, uh, and obviously, I mean, I, the thing is, if it's broken, the cats still have a place to stay, unless the door is just broken open. Yeah, but how am I going to wash my cats down? Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. <laughs> I, need to, I need to flash off a bit of text here saying, "Don't put cats in the washing machine, just in case, like, just in case anyone actually uses us in like a court of law somehow." I heard it from Dan these two British dudes. <laughs> In my experience, cats cope better with washing machines and tumble dryers. Right? <laughs> oh god! Just so how's your week been, <laughs> mate? It's it's. Do you know what? Actually, um, seeing like you you had some domestic troubles. Um, we we actually had um a leak in our boiler, um, which has been being sorted, and uh, and it's caused quite a large hole in our ceiling in the kitchen ceiling. <laughs> That's not so good. No, it's did not. Did you get the plumber I suggested? No, I did not because he lives in Karma Kamarvan and I do not live there. Uni! I think he would have travelled. You're alright? <laughs> we but also, so you suggested ready. it too late on account it's of the plumber that I did get turned up five minutes after he suggested it, so. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, I suggested that less late than your plumber turned up. That is true. Uh... <laughs> it's very true. But it's all fixed now, which is good. Um, so we just got, I've got to get in contact with the insurance company tomorrow, which is a very adult thing I have to do. Um, and, and, and speak to them about giving me my money back, please. Because that's what insurance is for. In other news, it looks like they killed Keenock. I mean, I mean, it was about time, to be honest. How do you reckon they killed him? Um, I think Led Enema. You Led enema. I, I was thinking just because he's a giant baby, they probably just shook him he a bit. Was a man who <laughs> craved power, and great power he oh my had, god. But he feared losing it. Well, my special cat Traveling tumble dryer. I <laughs> spent his days scheming petty schemes. Well, I love that. This is actually one of the misses that I think no that Final Fantasy X had. Yeah. Because you see, the eulogy to Wen Keenock actually makes him a much bigger character than he actually is in the game Death is a sweet and he actually could have been All a character who um he could have basically away. occupied the space that seymour does when you first kill him hmm. so you could kill him in the temple at, uh, at macalania having you know he's, he's gone through this whole thing of trying to avoid being killed and have to come up with things agree? you kill him in macalania he comes back as a as an unsent all the other Come masters reveal that they are unsent and he Come can't handle it and he tops himself. Like, to me, that would be a really cool, dark... With death on our side, we <laughs> Do you reckon maybe a bit too dark, though? Like, because the, um... There isn't... Like, a, lo a lot of this is, like, it's implied violence for a lot of things. Like, insofar as when people die, they don't die, right? Like, um... Like, there's a lot of that happening. So it's the whole, um... The idea of, uh, introducing suicide... <laughs> I mean, he just told me it's very subtle. He's just stabbed him in the chest with a big stick. Yeah, but it means nothing because he oh, uses. Bless. And also, it's Kamari. <laughs> he does that one he, damage. He, he actually did 20 damage there. <laughs> That's why. It's not actually because Seymour's really powerful. No, it's got nothing it's to do with that. Because Kamari's really. Just because fit. Kamari is not powerful at all. Oh, yeah, they weren't he's even real. Violence. No, no, those are actual people what existed. Oh, yeah. I I forget he goes mental at this point, doesn't he? Yeah, I mean, just... He becomes, like... Ooh. He becomes different, powerful versions of Seymour. Mm. I love how Kamari is just, just 
totally just like like he's he's into this. He's like, no, nope, I'm staying where I am. I'm not Holy. backing away from this obvious, <laughs> obvious like weird, like devil creature. Uh, I... Run, protect you now. Yeah, that's probably a good shout. Go. Uh, <laughs> I mean, if, if if we were gonna, I'm fighting. I said no. <laughs> if, if, if we were gonna sacrifice one member of the party, <laughs> like, <laughs> we love Kavari. We love him a lot, but also Kavari. <laughs> See you later, mate. Go get a class. Get an actual class, and then maybe we'll be okay. <laughs> oh no! As a guardian, protecting you is everything. Everything. Run. That's right. We're all guardians. Yeah. And you know what that means? Um, you know? Does it mean an oddly all sassy all hit? Post? Yeah, he's he's, he's like <laughs> half teapot in there. It's interesting. <laughs> In the original edit, he mm hmmed and clicked three times directly afterwards. I do kind of enjoy that though. It's re it's it's a really like it's an obviously stupid decision, but it's like that's what happens when you leave kids to make the decision, right? Let's go. Oh, I guess I guess if if you go, we have to go because we have to protect you, Yuna. So I guess if you just do this, I'll do it. It's like it's... if Yuna said jump off a cliff, <laughs> if you jump. I mean, oh. yeah, I guess yeah, I guess it, it, you you would because otherwise there's no gameplay. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's get rid of this cutscene. Yes, don't, we don't want to do that again. Oh, we we'll level up Yuna. Oh, oh, oh so I'm in. Fuck yeah. What's what's up there? What's that? I think we're heading our way over to some decent magic. You know? Not great magic. Dispel. Ah, do. yeah. That's handy though. Uh, as we found against as against uh, every. We'll quickly save again because we ought not to have done so before. Go. Oh. Quite Welcome to Oakus. <laughs> I adore Oakus so much. Still, he's just like because Oakus must have seen all of this go down, right? Like he must have just watched Seymour just turn up with, with like a priest of Yevon and also just like turn into this de demon creature and just go, oh, I better sell me wares. <laughs> I can make a few readies here. <laughs> I just wish he had like that, um, you know that that bag that Del Boy's got that can be unfolded into a table. Yes, <laughs> I, I wish I, that he had that. I need one of those. They're so cool. <laughs> I forgot they actually put mooks in this part. Like, I don't there know, are loads of mooks. Yeah, like, like I get an it. But unreasonable number. I get it, but I'm also like, it. It would have been cooler if you just had this like cool little run up to the boss battle. It'd be really. Like, I guess just to weaken you a little bit and make you spend some. This will be um, fun here because we've got a vague encounter now, so we can get out the way. And counter. A minute. <laughs> so so now so now Waka's better off just guarding all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He will probably very rarely do anything else now. Apart from eat shit, apparently. <laughs> He's doing a lot of damage though. Fifteen hundred. It's good. Yeah, yeah. It's good for a guy just with a ball. Yeah. Whoops. Man with yeah, a ball. You. Whack. Ah. Uh, I'm not proud. I mean, I didn't even dignify that as a response. <laughs> Just use a bit of water. Smart. Bang a bit of water on that. Right as brain. Sorry, Ifrit, but I'd rather you took a cannonball to the face than one of us. Yeah, um, you're very good at cannonballs to face, Ifrit. We've learned this. And also cannonballs to their face. See you later. Good work. Proper job. Oh, that went pretty well. It's a shame because we're going to gain a load of levels here and we're not going to be able to give them to Kimari, the only guy who needs them. <laughs> That's a really good point. That's such a good point. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm sorry Riku, I don't think we need you here, I think we just need Auron. Just to put out some hurt. That is what he's good at. <laughs> hey! He's gonna stand in the way of this bombardment, get out of the way, and it just makes no sense at all. No, I think it makes perfect sense, and I'm really happy about it. I'm so pleased that I found you before with no I, you know, I'm, I'm really pleased to catch your eyes open for, for that. It's um. It's, it's, it's good to see you know what you're doing here, you know what I mean? It's, it's... Yeah, it would have been a lot harder if I hadn't seen that. 100%. Yeah. Oh, sorry, Riku. <laughs> you got a nice glove. <laughs> Ideally, I want to fight one more. Thank see, you. It's almost as if you called it. If I can. Apollo. Then we can heal <laughs> Ifrit. Because those guys brought uh, portable Ifrit healing machines. Yes. Yes, they did. Ah, the, the Flemon Verfer. It's verse Flemon. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, it's fine. Oh god. <laughs> it's portable Ifrit healing machines. <laughs> They're Why actually... would they do that? They work for the Church of Yevon. Why do they not know that's a terrible idea? Uh, they're, they're actually the medics from Team Fortress 2. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Our special medical flamethrowers. Right, off they go. I do love the way he just, like, he just accelerates immediately. It's not like there's no wind-up. It's just an acceleration off screen. <laughs> I wasn't expecting dismissing him to actually be an action. That's, you yeah, know, so something new every day. Yeah, you? I was gonna, I was gonna say, I was surprised you did dismiss there, but also I wanted we, everybody to get some HP. That's all. Yeah, Sorry also, 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 you you just healed up um, Ifrit, even though we were about to hit a save sphere. Yeah, it's just fun, isn't it? <laughs> just need to play a game, isn't it? It's just, it's, it's just yeah. fun. I had some laughs, killed some time. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen Oren's health so low. Which is, you know, it's a shame because that's nearly Kamari's maximum health. <laughs> I mean, to be honest, if, if, if this game was truly, like, following, like, the actions that we've taken, then by this point, Seymour would be just standing over Kamari's dead corpse. I, I think that the second that we started the dialogue, you know, when Oren's like, we move, he would have just been torn apart at that point. <laughs> there and then. Quick bit of admin in front of Seymour. Smart. It's got to be done. He won't attack us while we're doing admin. No, he's, 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 he's too, um, also, he's too proud for that, right? Like... He's like, no, no, you proceed. <laughs> That's my best Seymour. Uh, boop, boop. To this day, I'm still upset that Wen Keynote wasn't played by Gilbert Gottfried. <laughs> That's because you're obsessed with Gilbert Gottfried. <laughs> I was very sad when he died. I was even more sad when I wasn't invited to the funeral. <laughs> uh, Not after last time, anyway. <laughs> I mean, that was the problem, wasn't it? Is I held a funeral for him several yeah. months before he died. Yeah. yeah, there's nothing wrong with him when you did, when you held a funeral. <laughs> he just looked a bit peaky. <laughs> and I wanted to make sure he was shown the proper respect. Oh. More Gars. More Argas. Now, do you know what my concern is here? No matter what we make our formation, we're not going to get a choice. How do you mean? Because Kimari's going to be in that party. Oh, like, which what slot sure. did he go in? Do you know? What 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 clue would I get 
of which clip where he's going to end up. Wait, it was a simple question. You could have just said, oh, I don't know, actually. <laughs> oh, because, yeah, sorry. Because it's random, yeah. Dan, as not opposed to, oh, it's always the first governor. slot. <laughs> not Scooby-Doo, governor. All right, let's go. If in. it's always the first slot, me and you are going to have issues. Now they all turn up and they're like, no, no, Kimari, get to the back of the party and try not to touch anything. <laughs> he just shakes his head. He's like, I, you, I had this. No, you didn't, Kimari. Ah, oh, it's middle slot. There you go. For anyone playing this at home, anyone playing along, Kimari goes in the middle slot so you can put someone you don't want there. Yeah, you absorbed like six people, mate. I'll be pleased when you're gone to the far plane. Bitch. <laughs> Blizzard. Oh. Oh. Wait, hang on. <laughs> Your Blizzard did multi. Right, we, we desperately need to get a Kamari out of here. Yes. Kamari, you've done a sterling job. Good work. Good work holding him off, Kamari. Well done. Yeah, yeah no. <laughs> off you fuck. <laughs> Chat. Although he was not the man I once knew, Kinok was still my friend, Seymour. You will pay for his death. Bitch. It's actually because uh, Seymour refused to pay uh, Oren for the hit he had put out on him. <laughs> Did you already haste Yuna? You did, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. I, I thought so. I, 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 thought, I thought I might have missed it. Oh, yes. All the nulls. <laughs> Commence the nulling. <laughs> oh, what the fuck is this? It's my, it's my favorite beer. What desperate. <laughs> Can't wait till you get haste to go. Just everyone be fast now, please. Oh. Jesus. He hasn't even talked to him yet. Maybe he needs to. <laughs> I'm just trying to have a chat, mate. Don't fuck it up. <laughs> Jesus Christ, they did a lot of damage. Oh, that's cool. So whenever you kill that thing, it takes 4,000. Okay, so that... Okay. So no matter what, you're always doing 4,000 damage to Seymour. An amount of damage yeah. to him if you take part in this. Hmm. I don't actually think we want him now. I think we want... Um... Whacker and his guard, but then no, he's he's he knows. He's... I think. Yeah, I was going to say because higher magical defense. Yeah, and also um, he's he's not. Yeah, he's 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 attacking multiple targets. He's not attacking just one. Like if he's attacking just him, then great. Bang. That's not going to be especially helpful, but you do you. That's the big problem. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was going to say, as long as... Pick it... the worst possible option now. Well yeah. Done. Um... Soft. The problem is that will turn off the haste, which is less than ideal. Mm. That thing's not hasted. We just jump back and haste someone else up yeah jump in I and I was going to say jump in and haste Lulu maybe so we've got to go fast hmm insert baseline from escape to the city here <laughs> yeah <clears throat> ow Yeah, we've not taken any damage on her yet.
Oh, and Yuda's lost her haste now as well. Take that, dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> it's a shame he's immune because yeah. that would have been the best possible way to win this. Here's how you end this fight. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> I love that that's a thing. itself <laughs> yeah let's just keep fucking with it um how do we do this just more and more reflect on everything I and mean, then yeah no matter what <laughs> yeah that's Jesus what we do. Christ. We reflect seymour natus uh why because we can we can bounce stuff off of our own thing oh and it will, it will hit them anyway because they can't reflect but if they try to hit us It'll bounce. But we can still hit this body thing. Yeah. Which will still nom him up. Oh, it does a thousand less at each time. Okay. That's all right. Because what we'll do, we're just going to do it offhandedly. Yeah. So, like, if the reflect hits the body, then hmm. we'll just now always do it. There we go. Cure. Welcome to hell! My <laughs> god. I, it's just it's just insane that this that this is a thing you can do. <laughs> <laughs> We've got much health left. Let's, let's just keep going. Keep going. Oh, never mind, we missed. Yeah, let's talk to him. Yeah, now, now, now's actually a good time. Now let's talk to him. Let's have a chat. You too seek freedom from this painful life. <laughs> Is it the painful <laughs> life of having all your spells reflected at you? How much I, health has he got left? I don't, I don't think it's, like, it's not even worth summoning. All. It's really not worth summoning. No, it is because you'll get the overkill bonus. But we'll wait a minute because we'll, we'll just we'll reflect one more spell for means. Go on, go on, go on, go on. <laughs> go on. Here we are. <laughs> and it's always curing, curing Tidus as well, or Joel even. Is it always kills Joel? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> go on, do it, My do it. Oh my god, this is, this is just... Killed with your own flair, you dick. It's just... <laughs> It feels so horrible. <laughs> it's like bullying. Why are you hitting yourself? Why are you hitting yourself? I like how, like, every time I seem to fight Seymour, I just do shit like that. To it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and now it's like, we escaped. With our we escaped. <laughs> no, we, we played with our food for like I 20 can minutes. Tell. Her faith was shaken. Yevon had betrayed her. I am. Um, I felt like I should do I'm or speechless. say something, anything. <laughs> did you enjoy? Did you like enjoy the experience came. of, of uh, just as lost as she was? <laughs> Seymour's <laughs> boss fight with me. <laughs> so two out of two Seymour boss fights have been absolutely trivial. <laughs> <laughs> Completely well, trivialized by Alex. <laughs> we're all clear. The overwhelming dominance. Oh it my took me God. almost the best part of two years of uh, Brick Twips to uh, form the overwhelming you know. dominance of Alex. <laughs> and all it took was Seymour. That's all it took. <laughs> Seymour made of this course. possible. <laughs> 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 
truly he is the hero of the channel. <laughs> must be tough for you. It must be tough for you now. Seeing her enemy yeah. die like that. <laughs> we're trying to, we're trying to, trying to touch the same sphere to end. Shit! <laughs> if you've enjoyed today's episode of Brit Twits, why not Please. give us a like, comment, subscribe? Please talk to Wacker or some more. <laughs> On your way. Bye. Five, six, seven, eight. Da, da, da. Sorry. <laughs> Don't put that in anything.